In about 30 minutes, Charlotte City Council is set to discuss big funding to help revitalize the Sugar Creek area. That money would help improve transit and pedestrian options in North Charlotte. WCNC Charlotte's Lexi Wilson is joining us live from the Government Center. And it sounds like, Lexi, it's really important for city leaders in their eyes to spend money in this area. Yeah, it is, and the Sugar Creek area has struggled with safety for quite some time now, so there's hope that this funding will make a difference because city leaders say it's desperately needed. The Sugar Creek area has made headlines. The crime in the area has created a tainted image of the neighborhood. The Sugar Creek corridor has been historically one of our underinvested areas, unfortunately. It's part of the Corridors of Opportunity, an initiative where the city of Charlotte invests big bucks into the six key areas of the city. They tackle issues around affordable housing, community safety, infrastructure, transportation, and business development. We're slowly seeing things change and improve there. The program has already successfully cut down on crime by building a business association here, and demolishing hotels in the area that have brought trouble for years. That's really helping to transform the area by reducing some of the transactional crime that happens there. Uh, as most people know, the interchange of 85 and Sugar Creek is right in between Atlanta and D.C. And um, it's tended to be a hot spot for people passing through and um, drug trafficking, human trafficking. Now, more safety improvements on the way. Monday night, Charlotte City Council will consider more than $10 million in state and federal funding to add sidewalks and improve existing pedestrian pathways on Sugar Creek Road. There's also plans to add three CATS hubs to provide connections between buses and other forms of transportation. It's something City Councilwoman Dimple Ajmira says will benefit economic mobility too. This is going to result in over $91 million in economic benefits such as improving public health, environmental health. Sugar Creek Road is one of Charlotte's most dangerous roads, seeing a high number of traffic deaths. There's hope this funding will also create change there. Most importantly, this funding is going to save lives. And the city of Charlotte has been working to eliminate all traffic deaths by 2030 through an initiative called Vision Zero. So across Charlotte, they've been adding new infrastructure for pedestrian safety. We're at tonight's meeting and we'll continue to follow it and bring you the latest. But for now, reporting live at the Government Center for WCNC Charlotte, I'm Lexi Wilson.